thank you for coming to my hijab tutorial, guys. <laughs> Thanks. People say the craziest shit to me after gigs, right? This woman come up to me the other day and she goes to me, oh my God, your English is so good. <laughs> and I was like, oh, please very much, please. please. <laughs> and then she goes to me, I love India. What part of India are you from? And I was like, oh, uh, Marrakesh. <laughs> I am Moroccan. And the other day I went into DHL to send a parcel to my cousin in Morocco, right? So I went up to the guy and I said, can I send this to Morocco? And he goes to me, is that in Europe? <laughs> I said, no, it's in North Africa. He goes, is that in Europe? <laughs> So North Africans and Arabs have a problem with the letter P, right? They can't pronounce it. So we'll be at a restaurant and my mum will give it with the waiter. She'll go, please, can I have a blade? You know? <laughs> Something kicks off around my way. She's like, Fetiha, call the bullies. <laughs> but the worst one is my dad. Like when we were younger, we'd be playing outside and he shout from the window. He'd go, Fetiha, go and collect your brother from the football bitch. <laughs> My mum is a proper lunatic, right? I always go with her to the doctors to translate, right? So we walk in, the doctor's like, how can I help? I start talking, she puts her hand out like this, and she's like, listen up, yeah, doctor. <laughs> oh, you speak English now, do you? <laughs> oh, okay. And then she's like, listen, I've got a pain in my shoulder, sort me out, sort me out. So he gives her a prescription, he goes, anything else? She goes, nah. He goes, okay, Mrs. Elgori, now we have to talk about your weight issue. She turns around, she goes, you what? I know speaking the English. <laughs> so I'm 40 years old. Yeah. I don't look it, innit? Yeah. yeah. When I tell people, they always say, they're like, no, you're not. I'm like, yes, I am. No, you're not. Yes, I am. And like 40 minutes later, they ask me, they go, what's your secret? Is it water? Is it anti-aging cream? Is it aloe vera? I'm like, no, babe, it's Allah. <laughs> One time I was in the airport, right? No, it wasn't one time, I've been more than once. <laughs> <laughs> and um, they, they pulled me over for a search, do you know what I'm saying? Like, surprise, surprise, <laughs> you know? And the woman was frisking me and she was proper rough, right? I was like, woo, afterwards, honestly. And I said to her, sis, you owe me a dowry, do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, we need to go half, half on my mortgage. I need to be on your life insurance. Like, what was that? <laughs> I've been married and divorced and uh, when I tell people that they always say to me oh was it an arranged marriage and I say no it was a forced one <laughs> being a hijabi Muslim woman that people have a lot of perceptions about us they think we're oppressed and stuff like that and I like to use that to my advantage do you know what I mean so like I used to work in this office and the girl working with me goes oh Fatia it's my 50th on Saturday can you come and like, I don't like her in it, but I'm not a bitch. I'm not going to tell her, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so I was like, oh, um, I'll have to ask my husband and get back to you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you.